Hey, I'm going to be showing you how to crack WEP and WPA encryption using the AirCrack suite in VMware. This method will only work for USB Wi-Fi cards and only with specific compatible drivers. Okay, so for this tutorial, you will need three things. VMware, the AirCrack suite, and a compatible Wi-Fi card. Okay, so let's get started by downloading VMware. Okay, so let's open up a browser and let's go to VMware.com. Okay, so we're going to be looking for VMware Workstation. Here we go, and let's download a trial. Okay, basically you're just going to be filling out all this info over here and then you'll get a download link. Once that's downloaded, just install VMware and We'll continue. Okay, once you have VMware downloaded, let's install the AirCrack suite. So let's go to aircrack-ng.org and let's click on the download and let's scroll down to where it mentions VMware. Okay, right over here, virtual machine, available here. See this page for more info. Okay, over here it's going to say what basically, what type of Wi-Fi cards are compatible. It says basically with these three drivers are compatible. So the one I'm going to be using, which is the Netgear WG111 V2, uses the top one, the RTL8187. So there are only three of them that are currently compatible. So if you have them, then you're in luck. Okay, so basically it says you need the VMware workstation. And that's basically it. So you could basically you could click on this link right here, download this VMware image here, and it's going to be in a .rar file. So you're going to need something to unpack it. See, VMware AirCrack MG 4.7, so WinRAR. Okay. So basically, save the file, and when it's downloaded, you need to unpack it. You should use something like WinRAR or something. You get that from download.com then WinRAR and right here you can just download WinRAR and that will unpack it once it's unpacked just drag it out of the compressed file and you should be ready to go okay so far you should have the VMware workstation downloaded and you should have unpacked the VMware AirCrack NG V4 okay so let's run AirCrack in VMware Workstation. So let's open up VMware Workstation. Click File, Open, and find where your VMware AirCrack was saved to. And click the AirCrack.vmx and click Open. Okay. Now you could tweak some of the settings if you want to go a bit faster, but I just use it what it, the default is. And let's just click Play. Okay, this could take uh, about a minute or so, so it starts loading everything in. Okay, so this is AirCrack NG running in VMware Workstation. Before we begin with the WEP and WPA cracking tutorial, I want to begin with first updating the AirCrack NG components. To do this, you'll definitely need an internet connection. To do this, you can either connect using wireless assistance, an ethernet cable, or bridging a connection with your VMware and your host. Okay, so once you have an internet connection, click this Wi-Fi icon, click MISC, and click Update your Crack NG. This could take a minute or so, but just be patient.
Okay. It's done. It says sleep 10. That means it's gonna close in 10 seconds. It should be any second now. Okay. The next thing I want to do is update the drivers for your Wi-Fi card. To do this, you'll have to plug in your Wi-Fi card. And my VMware version will show it right over here, my neck here. I'm going to right click and click connect, which will disconnect it from my host computer. And now that's dark blue. It's connected to my VMware. Okay. An easy way to update your driver is to click here, click MISC, and compile one of these three. How do you know which is yours? Well, an easy way to know is to just run the airmon command, and it will tell you. And it shows me. Mine is an RTL8187. If this doesn't help you, or if it doesn't show it here, either it's not compatible, or it just needs to be patched first, which you could first find online, which is your driver that you need. Okay, so I know that mine is RTL8187. So I'm going to click the Wi-Fi, MISC, compile, RTL8187 module. And this shouldn't take long. Okay, your Wi-Fi card should be disconnected at this point. Don't worry, it'll reconnect. Okay, it says done, sleep, 15. Okay. So, everything's up to date. Now we can begin the web and WPA cracking. Okay, first let's start with web encryption. Let's open up the shell console and let's type in irmon ng stop your interface, which in my case is WLAN 0. Minor mode disabled, okay. IF config WLAN 0 down. Mac changer dash Mac and we're gonna fake it to one to five zero to five and fake Mac there we go and airmon dash ng start WLAN zero this could take a second or two. Okay, minor mode enabled. And then you could just type in hero dump SMG your interface. And it will start scanning all the networks. And here's my network. TV twelve K. Web encryption. Good power. Okay. Well, that's all really annoying to type in every single time. So if you want to if you already know that you're able to go through all those steps and they all work you can create a script to do that all you gotta do is well I already created them right over here but I'll show you how I did it 